Hey, by me, 5 Math Projects. This is Coach Saiful with your daily dose of math mastery. And today we're going to move into the fourth question of your ratio math assessment paper. Today we have a huge question, so let's move in immediately. It says last year the ratio of the number of boys to the number of girls in a children's club was 4 is to 7. Um, this year, 42 new girls and boys joined the club. Not 42 new girls, but 42 new girls and boys together joined the club in the ratio 2 is to 1. As a result, the, the new ratio of boys to girls becomes 6 is to 11. So the part A asks you, find the number of boys in the club last year. So first off, let's do some things first. Let's write down boys to girls. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use different colors for this. So boys to girls, first off, this was last year. The number was, okay, I'm going to write it here, last year, yeah. Last year. So this was last year, am I right? So this is last year. Last year's um, ratio was actually, I'm going to use color blue here. Let's take a look again. The ratio was 4 is to 7, boy is to girls. Okay. And then what happened after that? What happened after that was um, boys and girls actually came in. 42 new girls and boys. Okay, make sure you see this very carefully. 42 new girls and boys, not boys and girls, because the ratio makes a difference. See, 2 is to 1. 2 is to 1, actually, um, what happens was, what happened was, the boys to girls is actually 2 is to 1. Ah, that's what they're trying to trick you over there. So don't let them trick you, okay? So here you have 42 new kids. When you add it, what happened was, it turned into 6 is to 11. So what happened here? What happened was, um, as you can see, there are there, there was an increase of 2 units over here and there's an increase of 4 units over here, which is different and 1 is to 2. So what must you do? 1 is to 2, okay, I'm just going to make sure you understand what I'm talking about. 4 to 6 actually gives you plus 2. 7 to 11 actually gives you plus 4. But over here, the original ratio was only 1 is to 2. But is 2 is to 4 the same as 1 is to 2? Of course it is, because all you have to do is times 2 to both sides, right? And you will get 2 is to 4. So what you can do now is you can say 6 units gives you 42. Because now you know that it can be applied on this one, okay? So 6 units equals to 42. 1 unit equals to what? 42 divided by 6, which gives you 7. So that means 1 unit here actually gives you 7. So the question is asking you for 4. Therefore, for the boys, 4 units actually equals to 4 times 7, which is equals to 28. So that's part A. Your part A answer is 28. For part B, let's move on to part B. Um, part B is actually, um, let's take a look. The question was asking you for, um, find the total number of children in the club this year. Total number of children in the club this year is actually equals to 6 plus 11 units. So 6 plus 11 units is going to give you 17 units. Am I right? Yes, 17 units. 17 units equals to how many? Equals to 17 times 7. Very simple. Use our handy dandy calculator. 17 times 7 gives you 119 children. And that's it. This here, you have 119 children. Very, very simple. All you have to do is to make sure you understand this part over here. This part, okay? This part over here. Okay? So I'm going to make this, um, I'm going to do it again because I think I went a bit too fast there. Okay, I'm going to explain to you again and this time and uh, bigger. So last year, boys to girls was 4 is to 7, correct? And then this year, boys to girls is actually what? 7 is to 11. What happened in between? What happened in between was you added, plus, uh, you added boys is to girls by 1 is to 2. Which also happened to be 42 kids. So that means this new ratio, 1 is to 2, 1 equals to what? 2 equals to what? Okay, I'm going to do it for you. In other words, 42 equals to 3 units, correct? Therefore, 1 unit is equal to 42 divided by 3, which equals to 14. 
Therefore, one unit here is 14. 14 boys, 14 new boys and 28 new girls entered. So what is the difference for, for from 7 to 4? 7 minus 4 equals to 3 units. Therefore, 3 units equals to the number of boys was, was what? The number of boys was actually um, 14, right? 14. So one unit equals to what? 